All right, weekly agility training method coming in here. Look, that's 70k. So that's not bad, is it? That's really not bad. So one more week and I'll be level 86. Then about three years, I'll be level 99. Fantastic. That's not a bad way to start a QBD Reaper, is it, though? Like, Royal Torsion Spring, straight up, 150k. That's not bad, is it? We'll take that. We have uh, so quite a few guys. I think 17 more. I might take a little while here, but that's okay. All right, halfway through, nothing particularly adventurous so far. But, you know, I guess the restores are nice. Like, restores and brews, uh, definitely can't complain because I am a little bit low on those. That is okay. Get a few kills. Quite a few, actually. But is that a, is that the same as I got last time? Another spring? I'm pretty sure that's a duplicate from today, but I, I could be wrong. Either way, second uh, piece of the Reaper. Just a phase. Like, if I do it here again, watch. <laughs> How to do phase four? Wait, that was a PB? Oh, that's... Cool. All right, Reaper done, and the final lootation is a frame. So I just got three pieces on this task. That's kind of cool. I think I've got like massive dupes on uh, both of those, but that's still okay. But yeah, as we still have a very uh, well, a large amount of gems and dragons on the task, it's going to be a very elite dungeon two e day again. But maybe we can get ourselves you know a brand new codex. Who knows? All right, Astalan coming through. Uh, no drops this time, only seven dust, a little bit of a scam, but that's okay, we'll keep going. Try and get these guys and maybe uh, Blast and Dragon will play ball. PB and J. There we go, Varakleth is now down. We're kind of hoping for not a codex, because obviously we already got one. Uh, we'll take the dust, a little bit more than Astalan, but still a bit of a scam actually. All right, here we go. First run of the day. Mr. BSD with six energies. I mean, it, it's not the best, it's not the worst, but it's pretty damn close to it. All right, another Astalan coming through. What happens this time? We've got double dragon hide. Wow. How very exciting. And 11 dust, but that's okay. We shall go again. But isn't it? 30 million ranged XP. That is not, whoa, almost dead. <laughs> That's not bad at all, is it? Big old 30. I actually beat it, beat, beat my melee stats to 30, well. Wow. There we go, I should finish this off there. Thank you to Serpent Shield for saving me from the big explosion. And the drop is a 21, nice. All right, Mr. BSD, what do you have for me today? We have 54, all right. Okay, that makes up for the bad runs before that. That's really nice. I will happily take that 54. All right, Astalan, what do you got for me this time? Only 12 dust, but that's okay. I'm actually got, I've actually got quite a few dungeoneering tokens, haven't I? We're actually not doing too bad. 322k. Let's zoom it up. All right, big SGB to finish. That'll do. That was a terrible kill. Don't worry about it. But you got to say, oh, 46 dust, though. That's not bad, is it? Cheeky little uh, double. All right, Blackstone Dragon, do your worst. Okay, when I said worst, I didn't mean worst, worst. But, you know, 11 energies, that's, you know, slightly above terrible. That's solidly mediocre, isn't it? All right, another Astalan coming through. What's going to be this time? My guy, go on, go on, go on, go on. Never mind. 22 dust. Very low in calories. Next. All right, there we go. Another one coming through, Veraglith. 16 dust. It's not the best, it's not the worst. We'll take it and I'll go. I think I'm gonna do the next bit as like the, the slayer method. Yeah, so the dragon method is you kill these two Hydex dragons, you get like, I think 17k XP each time. They, you teleport out, come back, and they respawn because that gate hasn't been opened yet. It's genius. Yeah, so with the scrimmage of sacrifice, these guys, instead of 17k XP, they give uh, 26k XP on slayer. Which is rather good, as you can imagine. So we're going to be zooming up the XP here. We've got five left on the task, so we have two plus two plus BSD, and we're now only 300k to well. I think we just got like 600k XP from like, uh, what, 30 kills or something of those dragons? We've got nine energies. It's not quite what you want, is it? Not quite, but it's also a Slayer task done, which is nice. We're a measly 240k from a level. Shame we got no good job today, that's okay though. The bad news is I have enough energies for a tectonic top. The bad news is I've got no Virtus. So maybe it's next time. I don't know about now, but at some point we've got to do a lot of next because some Virtus drops. Um, do not judge the Yak. This is purely for bruise and restore. See, here we go. Case in point. 
I need these things. That's why I have a yak. All right, we're just chucking it in there. That's how it works. I'm cool then anyway. There we go. Kill number two. Wish I had in my hill, but yeah, it's, it it is better this way because I I really do need like breeze and restores, and I can't get no pip until I get elder logs. So this is the way forward. All right, good luck. We've got Torsal Seeds last kill. This kill we get Magic Seeds, which honestly is probably just as bad in the current times with POF and everything. Okay, big Dark Break spec. 800 damage for the finish. That's a Virtus top if I've ever seen one. Oh, Bolt Slow actually. That's all right. We'll take that. Best drop so far. Very nice. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's not me. I thought that was me for a second. It's not. Uh, grass Mores on that defense bet, nearly 50 mil. And me on the Dragon Stones. This time, so again, we're looking for Virtus, remember. Uh, that's some Torva, which that's also quite good. It's a shame it's the boots, but that's actually a dupe as well. But Torva's good for future masterwork, we'll take that. Alright, another one down. Can we get the back to back? Is the question. Could it happen? Nope. Dragon Stones. But, you know, I actually really have to get that Torva though, it's really nice. Even though it's a jeep. Again, the yak coming in clutch. That's what it's for. Because it means I can mop up all of these lovely things and it's rather fantastic. Look at that. Look at that. Who even needs note paper? Am I right? What about this one? We're, what, 40 minutes into the aura now? It's actually going really fast in terms of time. And look, more brews. See the yak coming in clutch once again. Like, it's super important. Look at that. We're zooming up in supplies right now. All right, there we go. Um, this one, 18 minutes left, and green dehyde. That's actually a really good drop. I mean, I, it's okay. I mean, it's good value. But I do have like 20k black dehyde in my bank from like Raxor and stuff, though. Oh, look, a range level. Can we combine that with a drop? Uh, no. No, we cannot. That's some not very good seeds, but that's okay. And congrats, everyone, that got one. There we go. It took a little while to finish them off there again, but that's okay. What isn't okay is back-to-back -back stone spirits. I'd rather not have that, to be honest. All right, there we go. The final next kill of the hour aura is now out. What's it going to be? Ah, well, that's a slightly depressing note to end the next one, but at least we've got some boots. So it's not all bad, is it? Not all bad. Look at this. It's mushrooms growing on logs. It's a blooming miracle. I'll, I'll see myself out, I'm sorry. Okay, well, I didn't know you could do that. Apparently you can get zygomites from uh, doing this. I had absolutely no idea. I know they're quite common from like the actual mushrooms you got. I didn't even get them from this. But I guess that makes sense, doesn't it? But today I learned. Alright, rapture time. Looking for chain is the plan. Um, So hoping to get that. Carambola seeds, not really the best start. But yeah, it is what it is, isn't it? That's okay. Go boss. There we go. Okay, kind of a little bit too early. Oh, Onyx dust. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. We take those. Shame it's not like a full Onyx. I actually prefer that, but oh well. Damage boost. All right, good luck, everybody. What happens this time? Anything particularly amazing? If we can kill it. There we go. Uh, not free, but all You know, good for the cash stack. That's for sure. All right, another one coming in. Good luck. What's it going to be? Anything cool? And that adrens. Yeah, that's that's alright, isn't it? I, I've got so many of these to make into actual crystals, which we'll do at some point. Cheeky 30 minutes, unfortunately. Oh, we've got an HP level. Cool. Um, yeah, unfortunately, no thingamajiggies, but thank you for the kills, Mr. Ravler. That was beautiful. Did you very, very well. I did a pylon at Arch. Obviously, didn't get an Inquisitor piece, otherwise you'd have seen it. So that wasn't too good. Did some smithing for an hour, so we're actually getting pretty decently now. Almost 96, sort of. Just in 59 minutes. It's not gone well. But at least it was an armadillo piece, which is actually kind of good because we need those. Uh, but yeah, very, very unlucky hour here, unfortunately, on Warpriest. Moments after that clip ended, I got some gauntlets. So I've now had two Warpriest drops in an hour. I think it went to average like nine or something. So we got really, really unlucky here. No idea what happened, but, you know, here we are. All right, they just did a cheeky BM. I think we're doing another one as well. Almost slide right at the end, got to like a 7k through prayer. Wasn't pleasant ourselves eh, it's not the best is it i think we might have a cheeky reroll with that to be honest yeah definitely a reroll and uh, was it worth it honestly probably not but you know you win some release on menu and yeah i think it's a double i could be wrong but we'll um we will see i suppose
Okay, kill number two out of two. Let's see what happens this time. Uh, it's not great either, as I think we do very well again. And oh, that's a bit more like a two mil. That's not bad, is it? I've been spending the last little while doing some herb blocks. I'm literally completely out of drum pots. So I'm going to make, I think I'm making like 500 of these and then I'll make 500, 500 replenishments just after. And yeah, very fun. So there's actually been an interesting development at Rago recently. And uh, people have found out how to do um, a mechanic skip on phase four, which essentially saves, I think, like 40 seconds per kill, which is insane. So tomorrow, we may be doing some Virago and showing off this uh, this mechanic skip, which you can use in your kills. It's really easy to do as well. So we'll show you everything there and uh, yeah, hopefully make it work. Should be interesting. Maybe we'll get a seismic to boot as well. Who knows? But yeah, look forward to that tomorrow. And uh, yes, I will see you all. Well, I'll see you all then. I'm just going to do some herbal still while I render this video.